Johnny Esgato, Lotto Scratching, and we are scratching a $90 batch of California Scratch Tickets. Okay, so today we have ourselves a slight potpourri of flavors. Uh, we have a triple flavor pack, and what do we got? We are doing a trio of the brand new $10 Multiplier Mania, one, two, three. Then we are revisiting the uh, Monopoly $10 version. There it is, we haven't done these for a little bit. And just to uh, spice it up, we put in another one of our Nemesis Tickets, the Newest of the $30 tickets, the 200X. What the heck? Why not? So a couple different ones there, a couple three. But before we get to the scratching win excitement frenzy, let me grab this. I'm distracted. Okay, the coin of the moment coming into view. Here we go. And there you go. This is not technically a coin, but this is one I find to be fun because of the story behind it. This one is a commemorative uh, medallion, a token of Paul Revere. And you can see below it says silversmith because he was a silversmith. Paul Revere being the famous guy on the crying about the British coming, uh, right, that the Revolutionary War. What's fun about this is he was a silversmith. Now, being a silversmith, he had access to silver. When they first created the mint in 1792, they didn't have any coins as a, as a country. So even though he had access to silver, he seemed to be a little short, so what he did in conjunction with George Washington was he got his mom's silverware, and he and Washington produced the very first coins of the nation. <laughs> so they were called uh, Dismies, half Dismies, which is like a half a dime, five cents in silver. So he and Washington helped create the very first coins, and they came out in 1793. Oh, I'm sorry, 1790. Yeah, the Dismies were 92. Yeah, they came out in 92. So the same year the Mint was created, the Mint had not made any money till 1793. But uh, basically, and we don't know if he stole it, if his mom knew, but he took his mom's silverware <laughs> and he turned that into money. So anyway, I find that kind of amusing. Uh, I like to think that she knew, but you never know. She may have gone down to the kitchen and gone, uh, Paul, where is our flatware? Of the uh, known half Disney's that exist, yes, uh, the cheapest one I think is about seventy to 80000 Yeah. Um, and they go up from there. I mean... Wow, yeah, they're not... One sold at auction for, I think, $2 million. Uh, Yeah, we're not going to have any of those here. Okay, anyway, that's a little story about uh, Paul Revere. And that, but that is a silver piece, and uh, silver is about $25, $26, bucks, so that's going to be what that's worth. All right, look at this, folks. Look what I just put here. Third hand just handed this to me. So instead of a $90 session, it looks like we're going to have a $93 session. We have a bonus $3 ticket to Loteria, and Moochie's here doing a little dance. Oh, there's scratch dust everywhere. So let me get the scratch coin here and check out our bonus ticket. Thank you, third hand. It's a nice little interlude of surprise. Okay, uh, we haven't done these for a while. And uh, let's see if we can get something to go to kick off this session. So Loteria, $3, ticket 094. What do we have to do? Uncover the uh, cards here. And let's see if we can get a line like tic-tac-toe, bingo, or whatever it is. Okay, these are difficult to discern the difference between these and these, but we'll figure it out. So there is a pot of flowers, and I don't think we have one. Right, third hand? Correct, okay. we don't. I need your eyes to back me up. That looks like a wig. The and other one's the wig. Is that the wig? I don't know what that is. That's a stork? Yeah. But it still looks like a wig. They don't have it. Okay. All right, two blanks. There's a ladder. That one I can tell. I can discern that shape. There's a star. We have one of those. Hi, Mochi. Nice to see you. This is the lady. Lady. Bottom mm -hmm. right. La Dama. The lady. Okay, how about the harp? And nope. no harp. A pair. A pair of pears. The hand. El Mano. Indeed, it's right there. There's a parrot. Yes, top row. Yeah, right there. There's a Moochie over Moochie's here. there getting her eyebrows. She sees third hand and she's like, my eyebrows need attention. El Mundo. We got that. The wig. No. That's not the wig, see? Everything's the wig. <laughs> Everything's the wig. The ladder is the oh, wig. Moochie and her tail whipping me right in the eye. Very nice. Who needs to use both eyes? The boots is also the wig. <laughs> They're all the wig. There is a shrimp. No. No shrimp. A barrel of fun. Nope. We have the wow, cactus. This is like the least amount of matches. It is had. indeed, but we still have a chance. We get this bonus here. So if we get the chicken, 
The Gallo. That's it. No, the spider. The spider or the Gallo, and we got the boot. Yeah, well, we'll give this ticket the boot. All right, up your nose, ticket. Nice bonus there, third hand. <laughs> anyway, you never know when you're gonna find that win. All right, ticket 019, moving right along. The Monopoly $10 version there is Rich Uncle Pennybags, Mr. Money himself. And right next to him, we have bonus spots. If we find the uh, community chest, we can get a win. That $10 symbol. <laughs> yeah, it's no particular amount. It could be anything. But as far as we've seen, it's not usually gigantic. But let's find out right now. Oh, there's a nice uncovering of the prize. Neither one is a win, so whatever. Okay, so now we're looking for a match with a chance of a money bag. As you can see, it's a 10x multiplier. The macabre decapitated floating head of uh, Rich Uncle Penny Bags. That's a 20x. And then the go symbol, they're all mythical. We've not found any of those. All right, let's find that today. It didn't come out right to find out today. Find it today. I make my own language on the fly. All right, 32, 28, 36, 13, 26, 6. Lots of threes and sixes on this. And there's a two. Some moochie toes, double three. 39. A single three. A 23. 42. 27. 29. 54. 19. And these tickets, by the way, folks, are from a location where we rarely pick up tickets. Only a few times in the past, but we were near it today, so maybe it'll give us a little good luck. 35, 24, number four. Number one, 56, the snowman. 48, double nickels, 55. 49er, 47. Okay, last row. 58, a 15, 18, 34, and no good. We're batting zero here. Oh, uh, we are indeed. Back to back losers. One of these days, we'll I'll be finish it again. But don't hold your breath. Well, we had ticket zero one eight. A uh, profit session today on today's slots. We had a profit session yesterday, yesterday slots, and yesterday's tickets. Yes, so we want to keep up the tradition right now with today's session and give us a pair of pairs. All right, community chest, bar of soap, no, and a round thing. Nice segue there, by the way, third hand. Segue isn't spelled S E G U E. <laughs> <laughs> but why? <laughs> Uh, language is a... Who's in charge of this? You need to tell them something. <laughs> language is an odd thing. 45, 41, 58, 9 or 4, 17. And again, in English is what I know, obviously. It's very odd as the way it's been compiled over the years. Other languages, I assume, are similar. I don't know enough about them to know how strange they can be to native speakers. But um, you know, English is a potpourri of everything. Uh, okay. And I don't know how to use any of it. 45, 41, 58, 9 or 4, 17, and neither of these are any good. 7, 21, 15. 43, Moochie. A single 3. 57, Moochie Shadow. Oh, Moochie. That one almost went <laughs> my nose or tail. Gosh. A single 1, number 5. 16, I think you guys have been practicing. Not only is she smacking me, she's making the circle in a very precise manner now. Right past us. 16, 54, 42, 39, 29, a double two, 27, 31, no, 59. No good. Moochie toes, double three, some chicken legs. 38, Moochie Eclipse. Oh, again, Mooch. <laughs> I think she's really aiming. 14, 32, double four, and three in a row losers. Hmm. Oh, we oh, have maybe one more Monopoly. Yeah, we, uh, <laughs> keep giving me the long one. Three times in a row. That means this is going to win because it didn't want to show up. All right, ticket 0 2 0. This is our last chance with the Monopoly, or the Monotony, the way these losers have been. 
bar of soap, and a toilet seat. Well, those kind of go hand in hand. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. All right, moving right along. 56, Niner. 16, 6, a 41 and or a 43. Tally ho. 17. 39. Those toes of Mooch. Not matching. 49er. 46. 31. 27. 32. 29. A 13. A single 5. 57. 48. Number 2. 23. 38. Come on, let's get that Go symbol. Yes, 38, 7, 52. The last time we got double two. What? Cla Thir claimers, they were like two months apart. And then before that, it was like two and a half years. Yeah, we don't want to go another two and a half <laughs> years. We never had uh, a Monopoly claimer. No. 59, double four, 15. Uh oh. Uh oh, 45 and Whoa. three in a row losers, Mr. Money. Holding out, holding out on this. He's done well on these. These have done okay. Ticket 040 of the new ticket, the Multiplier Mania. Okay, these are like the uh, similar million dollar multiplier, except these have $50 fast spots here. So let's see if we can uncover a 5 0 while Moochie's in front doing some Moochie maintenance. That doesn't work, neither does that. So now we're looking for a match. If we get a match, the multiplier is connected here, so we won't find an independent uh, multiplier. But if we find a match, multipliers are 2, 5, 10, 20, or 50. There's also a money bag, which is an instant $100. All right, 42, 6, 12, 46, 27, and 14. One of those needs to come through. Hey, the toes of Mooch. 23. <clears throat> 21, A39, double four, 13, 32, 29, 7, A16. Come on now, tickets. I messed up our back to back profit days. We don't have one yet. Well, we have a partial. We have one and a half days. We need to make it a pair equally. 36, 38, Niner and a 30. So let's get down to the bottom row. 24, a single three. 41, snowman and 31. And Jeez. wow, that's five in a row losers. That's too many. Too many. Well, you only have after that two more tickets. Hmm. Well, let's get three in a row wins then. Ticket zero, four, one. Ticket 41. Fast 50 would make quite a difference. 56, 52. Mm. <laughs> Moochie, what does that look? You want know, to try to show her? See if you guys can see Moochie's face as she's looking at us in a kind of a starey, like, glancy way. Hi, Mooch. Deadpan Mooch. <laughs> she's actually alive. She's not a stuffed animal. She looks like a toy there. All right. Hopefully that shook it the ticket up. Shook it, shook it the ticket. Now I'm singing the song. Shook the ticket up. We'll make it want to win. We have 21, 36, 28 chicken legs. That's number 11. Number six or seven. Third hand's doing here. the focus. One moment, should I move my hand? No, you're good. Thank you, young man. All right, 39, 35. Ah. Stay clean. 46. A single four, 15, 37, A25, 34, double four, A14, 30, 13, double threes again, number eight, 38, last row. 43, 24, 12, <laughs> 31, and Niner. My goodness, nothing, nothing, and nothing. Last chance of these, ticket 042. 
gonna take a breath. Okay, here we go. 54 and nothing. You gotta recharge those toes, Moochie. 27, 25, 24, 42, 7, 45. She just showed up here to tell me a thing or two right here. Purring away. All right, we got a 36. You bringing some luck with you there, Mooch? Good luck, that is. 13, 29, the Moochie Toe. A single four. 46, number six. 39, 15. That's a 34, no good across the board there. 14, double ones. 31, 37. 28, 41, 35, double, 2, 8, 32. Wow, they're all losers. We're on to the last ticket. We have one chance here. The $30 200X, our nemesis ticket. Will it come through for us and save the day? It's ticket 011, the chicken legs and a hula hoop. Because why wouldn't a chicken want to use a hula hoop? All right, now, the money roll. A mythical symbol. Let's see if we can find one in any spot would be good. Oh, Moochie. There's a Moochie tail encroaching. <laughs> Move that thing. And a fuzzy windshield wiper. Come on. Thank you. And no money roll. Yeah, just a made up concept of an idea. All right. So now we're looking for a match with a chance of multipliers being a 5, 10, 15, Donkey 1. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 100 or 200x a win all birth symbols possible a bit of a good luck donkey kick there 29 double 4 32 35 a single 4 27 moochie toes double 3 51 double nickels and or a 47 yep okay last chance this has to be a magnificent one hit wonder 59 double 2 a 58, 43, a 46, 53. Come on, where's that win all burst? Let's see that. <clears throat> 14, 48, 25, 19, 23, 49er. 56 and 45. Number Snowman, the 8. 31. 38. 28. 34. Niner. 15. Number 3. We need a double. We got a single. 26. 42. 17. Uh-oh. We get into the uh-oh land. A 12. 7. Come on, win all. <laughs> Number 6. You can save the day. 13. 41. I don't want to finish scratching this ticket. <laughs> just leave it as a possibility. It just needs to be a mystery. <laughs> we shall uncover the mystery. 21. 24. And it's a straight loss across the board, folks. Oh, it hurts. A blank session. Wow. Well, that was untasty. Uh. <laughs> Actually, it tastes pretty bad. But, again, it is gambling. And we have to reinforce the fact that more often than not, you will not win. Once in a while, you might. Once in a while, we might. And hopefully, we'll be here when we do. <laughs> it, wasn't, it wasn't today. This session is as satisfying when, as Muchi steps in my cereal. Yeah, Muchi. <laughs> <laughs> Mucha likes to get into, she likes to investigate things. All right, folks. Well, there you have it. We gave it a try, and today was not as nice as yesterday, but that won't stop us. We will do something again tomorrow. Hopefully, you'll still be here with us. Thank you for making time nonetheless. And if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe, the thumbs up, share with a friend, and of course, leave a comment. So that's going to do it from myself, third hand. Oh, whip me in the eye with your tail, Mooch. Be well, be safe, be here, and we'll see you next time. Take care, folks.